Hey, how's it going? Today, we're doing a ton of mining over on Copper Island. So in the last video, we were over there, got quite a bit of resources, we got some clay, we've got a ton of stuff from the animals, right? We killed some of the buffalo, so we got a lot of leather, we've got a bunch of foods and stuff. I got most of that kind of processed and kind of set up. So what I want to do today before we head out is we need to make some leather armor. So I have been super busy <laughs> getting this stuff ready. The amount of fresh water I used to make that leather, oh dude, it is a ton. We got a bunch of the tinted threads. I need to make up our knife right before we go. So I have that here. I've got the other piece there. Let's check on this here. Oh yeah, I had to make another one, man. I tell you what, just doing one at a time takes forever. Two hours. So we got enough. That's going to be extra. So we do have a couple extra pieces that we're not using. And like I said, man, that thing right there, luckily it rained for two days in game. I used all of the water from these and then I made quite a few trips over to the fountain. So it's not too bad, man. Not too bad. Let's start off with the knife. And get that done and out of the way. Our flint, man, is almost broke. So I was going to go ahead and build up one of the new ones, right? The py pyrite fire. Words are hard sometimes. But we're missing flint shards. I'm not too sure where we got our other ones. I think one was on the mountain up there. Haven't found any more. So we're kind of in a bad spot because not only can we not make that, we can't repair this or anything either. So yeah, fire is going to be an issue. We're going to have to go back to the old way of using that. Speaking of it, let's take it with us. We need a short handle. Make one of you. And we need to go over to the workbench and make up the blade and then the knife itself. And then we'll start building on our leather armor. Let's see, let's do... Knife blade, one of you. Oh, we need a hammer. Well, I'll tell you what, we need a hammer anyways. We got our trophy I want to set up. Hammer's almost broke. Let's get some stuff to repair it. I think it's two of these. Dude, we need to... I think we need to build a new one here soon. Oh, we do. So next time this thing breaks, we need to just build another one. Hopefully we'll have some copper by then and be able to just upgrade it all together. That thing should last a long time. Let's put this down here. And let's place this out. Get it out of our inventory. Super heavy, man. Three pounds for that thing. Oh, it's not too big. Kind of wish it was bigger. I thought it'd be bigger than the harpy trophy. Let's just do it right under the pig. Nice, man. Nice. So we got the Harpy Trophy at the top. Super colorful. I like it. I kind of wish the other things had more colors. I mean, yeah, I kind of understand why they don't, but it would be nice. We got our two smaller ones on the sides, our boar, and then the buffalo. Now, I'm not too sure if there's other animals we haven't seen yet. I think that there's some deer, right? I've seen on the splash screen whenever you're starting the game that there's some deer in there. I'm not too sure where those are. Might be on one of the islands that are still locked for us. Let's put you over there. Alright, so we need to finish this. I Look. <laughs> look, man, let's not talk about it. I just grabbed the hammer, and now we left it. It's heavy, man. I try not to keep it in our inventory very often. Alright, so, 34 minutes on you. Then we need to build the actual knife itself. And that is sorted out. Nice, man, nice. Alright, let's get rid of the hammer this time. We're for sure done with it. I think. Possibly. Maybe not. Oh yeah, the book too, man. Let's finish that thing. So, I read most of it. I think we got like two or three hours. Two hours left. Living water cures disease. Interesting. So, I'm not too sure about that, man. I don't have any points. So, the living water, right, is kind of rare and it is limited. So, I guess if you're in a very bad spot and you're getting ready to die and you got a bunch of bad statuses, you could... But why would you not just die and then use the living water to fix yourself? Not too sure. Kind of weird. Here's what it is, though. <laughs> oh, yeah. All the uh, stuff I did get processed up. All the foods and whatnot. Dude, it's a ton of food, man. So what I've been doing is making some of the salted lard. And then we got some in the dehydrators. And we got some of the meat, too. I made up quite a bit of the salt. However, we have used it. Dude, these things are so going... Three and a half hours. It's two for each one, so don't forget that's a lot. So we kind of use that so it doesn't spoil. I figure we do those first because with the meat, right, we can always cook that on the fire. Kind of go from there. Our storage is full for our medical stuff and our food. We might have to build some more soon. Dude, I tell you what, the amount of storage we use in this game, it's kind of crazy. Eat a couple of you. All right, so what do we need for making our leather? It's made at the improved workbench. We need a couple of the needles. 
And then we need to make one set of the rope skins. So let's grab the fish bones. We'll just grab the whole stack. I'm not too sure how many we'll need. And we do got the one needle. Let's go ahead and use it until it breaks. I know we got one of the ropes in there. But I want to uh, just make one because we get two for one. And we need two for the building, I think, right? Yeah, we need two. So it doesn't really make sense to uh, grab that one. So let's do... We'll do five. Should be enough. It is nighttime already? Holy crap, dude. Let's take a nap. We can't build anything anyways. I don't want to waste our little bit of fuel we have because I've been making food with it. It takes so long to make the... the fuel for the lights, right? Nine hours on you. Alright. Jump right into this. Actually, these are done, right? They are. Let's take all these. So I don't know if these things spoil. If you do not take them out. If not, it's kind of nice to leave stuff in there until you're ready for it. I think we're kind of full over here in our storage, right? Just about. Oh, it's done at the workbench, right? Look, look. Back up, man. Back up. Workbench. Focus. Focus. We got so much to get done today. All right, let's start off with that. It's going to take... 40 on that. Only an hour. It's not too bad. Let's make some more... Oh, wait. We got needles, right? Okay, so that's done. Wait, leather hood. We already have that. Oh, that's made for the copper. That's right. Super expensive. I mean, we'll probably upgrade depending on how much of the copper we get. Let's make... That part we need the rope for. We'll do that in a minute. Let's do the pants. It's always good to have pants, man. We're using a ton of our needles. <laughs> we really need to get the copper ones. I would do the boots. Make sure I do not accidentally double make something because, dude, I would be so sad. It's taking forever off camera to get the, uh, the stuff together. All the hide made. We need... Wait, where is the... It's made. Regular workbench, okay. I thought it was made somewhere else. Alright, one of you. Oh, that's made with dried hide. Oh, I almost messed up. I thought that was for the leather. Interesting. Good thing we have some of those done. And then all we need now is this. And that is the last piece for our leather suit. Nice, man. Nice. All right. So I really wish it had a full rating for your armor and stuff. Unless it's a, that's what it is down here, I guess. Right. Let's let's put all this on and see. It does. OK, so we got 20 percent on our armor. 100 percent on the sun. Oh, dude. Rain is 100 percent. Zero percent on freezing. Wind is 100 and overheating is 100. So, <laughs> dude. I made up so many of the termite things over here. We've got six of them. So we're kind of set. All of our water is full, too. So that's a thing, man. We don't need those anymore. And then... With these, we didn't have any of that, right? All we have for this is just the sun. Interesting. I wonder how long it's going to last, too. Let's go ahead and just destroy these. We'll get some stuff back. We're not going to wear those ever again. Hopefully. We'll see. It kind of sucks that... Just wearing stuff, you take durability instead of whenever you get hit. So it might be nice around base to wear something like this just to kind of save our suit, right? All right, so that's all that gone. We got five of those left and one little needle. Oh, we got six of those. Just destroy all those. Wait, that was a good one. All right, well, is what it is. Look. <laughs> Mistakes were made, man. It happens, dude. It happens. Get all this sorted back out. Leave the needle. We're taking that with us. We don't need... How is it out here? They are ready to be changed out. So, like I said, I did make two of these. Because it was taking so long, man. Now, one of you. 
and one of you. That should be everything that we have for hide. We got two of the dry hides left. We'll save those because we need that for the ropes. One piece of leather for repairs. Are we good? We got the blade. Ah, dude, the flint is so bad, man. That's all good. We got this we need to do while we're over there as well. I've got another shovel made. And then let's grab a little bit of water. That's empty. That is as well. So we shouldn't have as much issues with our water and stuff over there now, right? Seems how we got the good armor. Let's take a couple of these for the trip. Let's head right over. We'll do some sleeping. I think we have everything. Let's double check. So we've got the shovel. We've got some food. We're going to leave in there. We've got all of our water. I got an extra coconut as well. Just one. I know. <laughs> I probably should have got more. Let's leave that. We don't need all of the tendon thread either. I think we're kind of set. So the goal is to grab copper. That's the main thing. And then we'll grab some of the clay as well. Whatever's left over for space. And then if we can, maybe some of the stuff for the, the moonshine, right? We want to go ahead and get some of the agave and then some of the, I think it's the cactus, right, that we need? Let's do this. We're going to Copper Island. Now, I do want to build one of the docks, so I was thinking. I was going to build it here, like in this video. But what I want to do is go ahead and get one of the other boats made, I think. The catamaran. So we'll try to build one of those maybe in the next video. Depends on how many resources we need. I think we just need one of the copper ingots. We'll get that kind of set, and then we'll see how big of a docking area we need at our, our base that we have now, right? Over on the main island, and then we'll work on one over on Copper Island. Because don't forget, I am wanting to build a little shack and stuff over on Copper Island, just so that we got some place to protect ourselves from the sun, maybe do some processing of the copper over here, things like that. So we'll see, man, we'll see. We'll just go ahead and get over here, get some of the copper, and hopefully not die to the jaguars. And that's the other thing, too, right? We actually got some armor, so it should help out whenever we get attacked. And we got the obsidian arrows, so we're kind of in a better situation than we have been before. So, not gonna lie, man, kind of excited, kind of nervous. Definitely want to see how well the copper pick is that we have, versus, you know, using the stone, right? Well, good morning. Figured I'd go ahead and sleep. It was kind of late in the afternoon. So we are over here at the spot we usually come to. It should be empty. We got a little bit of the tree bark, not a problem. Let's just go ahead and leave that one in there as well. So, let's grab our... Yep, I didn't want to get wet. That's a thing, though. Let's grab that. We'll grab one thing of water to keep in the... cart with us. I think we're kind of good on everything else. Wait. We got flint there. Ah, oh, dude, we could use that for making the other fire starter. I did not realize we had one in here. Interesting. Okay, well, that's not too bad. Let's leave you and you, and we'll leave you as well for right now. So I think we're kind of set, man. Let's head over. Try to go to the camp first, and we'll see what's up with the inkwell, what we have to write on that piece of paper. That might be part of the storyline stuff, right? We had to do something with a map showing us where the copper was. Now, I'm not too sure why that would matter. I forgot about the coffee. We could have made some coffee, man. I see you over there, spider, doing spider things. I'll tell you what, it's not safe over here, but it might be part of the storyline stuff that we need. I'm not too sure, man. Not too sure how that works out. The harpy is back. The jaguar is back, too, so I'm not really excited about that because if we start taking durability on our armor, man, it's going to kind of suck. I mean, we just made it, right? Stay up there. I'm going to go run right by. Not going to touch your nest. Yep, I hear you. Is there something... That's one of the lizards, man. I hate those things. Look, look, look. Let me get out my weapons, man. Look. We're just talking about our armor. Yep, come over here, man. Come over here. Okay, okay, look. <laughs> it's probably not the best. I don't want to throw the obsidian one because I'm scared I'm going to lose it. Sorry, we got the stone one. Yep. <gasps> See? That's what I'm talking about. Totally lost it. There's another lizard. Dude, I just want to do a little bit of mining today, man. Where is... Dude, we launched that spear, man. Way over there. At least we can see it. It's kind of a nice feature having... Having that, you know? Highlighting your stuff. 
There we go. Uh-huh. Serves you right. Didn't even want to mess with you today. I'm going to take all your stuff, too. Appreciate your donation. And appreciate the damage you did to my armor. How is it? Not too bad. It shouldn't be, man. It shouldn't be. Our belt is getting kind of to where we need to repair it here soon. We got two of the lizards as well. Main thing I want from these is the hide. Well, I guess all of it, right? Just take it all. We'll use the stone one up, and then we'll go ahead and trash that. Now, was that the only one? Oh, we had two that we killed. Not worried about it. We got other things to do today. So we still took quite a bit of damage, man, for the uh, for the armor that we have. We're down to almost what? Lost about a quarter. Let's try this while we're here. So we needed the the sextant as well. Here's one here. Oh, we need a copper ingot to repair it. Interesting. I think we need that for this, right? So we need one copper ingot. We can repair that and then do some mapping here. That might be what we have for here. The captain's camp. Yeah, the captain's camp. That's where we're at. Take note with a map. So we'll do that, man. We'll try to get one of the ingots and get that repaired. Can't do that today because we have to go back to our other base to do our repairs. Is that a live one or is that a dead one? It's alive. Very much alive. And now it's very much dead. <laughs> Let's go ahead and harvest. We need that for something. I can't remember what it is. Alright, so this is done. Before we head up to the new mine, let's stop by the old one. And see what's up with the respawn time. Or the respawn amount on the actual copper mine. I'm guessing it's going to be like one or two of the ingots. I think it needs to set for quite a few days before you get a bunch of them, right? Leave you there. And let's see where the Jaguar is. Here's the old one. Finally rotted away. We got just the remains of a big predator. It's definitely a big predator. Let's change this over to obsidian. Snakes, okay. Lizards? I see you. Yep. Not faster than my arrow though, are ya? I don't want to harvest it, man. Where's the Jaguar? There he is. See, I know he's over here. Alright, let's... Sneaky, sneaky. He's right by the copper mine. Garden like he should be. Good bit of cactus over here. So we'll kill him, harvest him, and then we can always come back for the cactus after we get our other ores and stuff. I need him to stop moving. I have not got any good shots. Right in the head. Let's get another one. <gasps> Two arrows! Two obsidian arrows! Oh, that is fantastic! I even shot him in the leg with that last one. Nice, man. Nice! Let's grab all of this. So that's going to be 13 minutes versus an hour. Oh, 51. Okay, let's do this. Let's do... We harvest anything. There we go. That's broke. Finish that. Alright, how much have we got in here now? And let's trash this. Still don't understand why it takes 10 minutes to trash something. One! Oh, dude! So we definitely need to let this go for a while. Interesting. So what we might do... 20 days for the respawn. We can kind of judge it on that. Maybe we'll come back in 10 days and check it again. So it's been 20 days already. It has respawned. We got one. <laughs> that is not... <laughs> dude, that is not a good ratio on time. But it kind of keeps it from being too overpowered, right? If it respawned full every couple, you know, days, you know, 20 days, whatever, then you could easily farm it all up. So long as it gets more over time, I kind of like that. We'll have to, I uh, have to see. I still haven't paid attention to the other stuff that has respawned to see if it kind of picks up more over time. So let's do the one up here on the right. We know that there's a... A jaguar over there. There's also some new stuff for us to take a look at, too. Yep, scorpion. Okay. Dead scorpion. Oh, thank you, thank you. I need to cut myself a path through here. One day we'll do it. One day. Our health is getting so low, too. 
All right, so we got some stuff over there. Let's drop this over by the mine. And we need to get rid of the Jaguar. Wait, there's the remains from a Jaguar. Is the other one here yet? It's here. Thing is, where is it? It's gonna come out of nowhere. I think last time it was over there, wasn't it? The lizard, okay. Things are super fast, dude. Give me the arrow. Ah, there we go, the hide. That's the main thing. Take it all. Take it all! Nine minutes. Oh, 36 minutes. Where's the Jaguar? There's a ton of the cactus over here, though. The agave's back in the plains, kind of where the boat's at. <gasps> Is that another copper mine? Is that clay? Might be clay. Oh, is this pineapple? It is! Interesting! Harvest you. Nice! New blueprints. What have you got? So that's 10 food and 15 water. Oh, the sweating potion. That's right. So that's going to help out with overheating, which we don't need now, since how we got the leather armor. But it also restores water, cures diseases at 4 degrees. So that's not too bad. 11 health in one hour. All right. Do we not have a Jaguar? It says that it's on the map. Is that a cave? A place to get out of the sun. Oh, speaking of that, yeah, it's nice not having the, uh, the sun on us. We can probably climb up there, too. I hear you. It's right over there. Just a lizard. Two of them. It's gonna be a ton of clay. We'll save the clay. Well, I'll tell you what, we'll go back over by the thing. 17! Oh, dude, that is fantastic, man! It's an actual clay deposit. Got you? Uh-huh. You tried? Swing and a miss. I will take all your stuff, though. It's getting late in the day. <laughs> it's almost nighttime. We gotta run all the way back and, uh, and sleep again. Feels like we haven't got anything done for this one in-game day, you know? So what do we need to harvest this? Nothing! No tool needed! How long? 135 on the weight. Oh, we do need a shovel. Six and a half hours. Oh, we're gonna grab that before we go for sure. We've got to, man. We've got to. If we have enough weight on the boat, that's a thing. I don't see the Jaguar. We might be somewhat safe. Safe fish! We are never safe! We good? It lied to us, man. All right, so let's do this. Drop you, and you, and you. All the heavy stuff. Get rid of that. Let's see, we've got five left in here. So it's going to save us 57 minutes versus the stone one, right? Am I reading that right? Twenty-three minutes on one. Saves twelve. Okay, it's not too bad. They should help us out with our... Our stamina's still going to go down. Ah, uh, I should have made some coffee. Alright, let's do... We can't harvest all of them. We can! So that's done. Thirteen days for respawn. Okay, that's not too bad. Let's put all of this into here. And I think what we'll do is we'll drag this just to the front. Now we are going to come back. Well, I think we can go ahead and do it now. I was going to say we'll come back and read this stuff, but let's read it now. The tablet about Fernand's fate. Juan Ponce de Leon and Fernand Delgado found an ancient copper mine in the depths of the island. The explorers were about to start mining the ore. When a huge beast jumped out of the bushes and rushed to the commander, the conquistadors had never seen such a ferocious predator before. Fernand did not hesitate and struck the animal with a well-aimed shot. 
His quick response is the only thing that saved Juan Ponce de Leon. With the beast defeated, the friends filled a cart with copper ore and returned to the camp. The sailors were able to use the ore to forge strong patches and reliable tools to repair the San Cristobal. The ship and four small boats were soon fixed and ready to sail. This time, Juan Ponce de Leon decided to act for sure. The commander organized several search parties to study the nearby islands and their weather. Knowledge of the region was to help the sailors make their way through the Beamini Belt. I found a list of places with coordinates where the search parties and the commander himself had gone. If I can determine the coordinates of the island I am currently on, I could draw a map and then figure out where to sail to find Juan Ponce de Leon. Nice, man. Nice. So that kind of explains a little bit more on what we have to do with the table, too, right? So in 1513, we mined copper here in an ancient mine to restore a damaged ship. Continue the expedition and search for the Fountain of Youth. Okay, we already know about all that. Nice, man. Nice. I like it whenever they read stuff out. I like their kind of little animations they have with that. It's kind of nice. Anyways, moving along. I noticed, too, they had one of the really good cards that had the, the bigger chest on it. Dude, I can't wait to get one of those. What are we missing for that? I wouldn't mind having one of those over here and leaving it. We need three ingots and then some wood planks. Where's it made at? Just on the ground, right? We can definitely bring stuff over and build that here. Kind of what I want to do. If this is the only island for copper, and if we let it re like fully respawn, it's definitely worth it to have it over here for sure. I just drag this up here while I wanted to. We'll leave you right here. Let's check this one last thing. Well, we kind of need... It's late in the day. We definitely need our energy. So let's head back to the boats. We'll get a little nap in. We'll come back. We'll check out the other copper mine over there. But we also need to read that other thing that's over here. Boy, I tell you what. Look, dude, look. Serves you right. Give me that. We're not going to have an injury. <laughs> we'll come back for it. But we definitely need our energy. And then we'll come back and read that one thing. And totally clear out that other one. If we can, we should be able to. All depends on the durability for our our pick, which didn't use much at all for five. That is so nice, not having that thing break all the time. Kind of expensive if you think about it, you know, having the copper tools. But they last quite a while, it seems like. I wish there was a copper... Wait, there is a copper shovel, right? There is. Okay, that'll be even better. 400 durability versus 80. Massive difference. I will see you in the morning. Ah, another lovely morning. Dude, it is so nice not having to worry about the sun or the wind or anything like that or overheating. Game changer, man. Game changer. I like it. Kind of wish we made this armor earlier. Oh, it's another piece of the natives map. So I'm not too sure, man. I don't understand this. We got so many pieces. And there's no real use for it. I mean, they're all over the place, right? It's what it is. Nothing else here, though, huh? All right. It's what it is. It's what it is. I didn't forget about you, clay deposit. I kind of want the ores and stuff first. We'll come back for that afterwards. So, this side is totally done. A lot of stuff here, man. A lot of stuff over here as far as the cactus, too. Need to come back and harvest that. We might actually do all of the moonshine stuff in one video. Come back over here. We'll grab all the stuff we need because every time I try to get it with the copper, it's just we're, <laughs> we're out of space. I really want to see how much we've got on yep. On that new boat. For space. For storage. Gotcha. Almost missed. I'm not worried about it. We're fine. We're fine on that stuff for now. They respawn over here quick enough. But this other one should be over that way, right? It is way over that way. Cannonball. We need some stuff from the cannonball tree. That's going to have the branches, I think, right? That we're missing? What do they call it? The strong ones or the sturdy ones? So we definitely need to stop by that, harvest that up regardless. I hear you. Dude, the lizards, man. I wish we could outrun them. You can't. Those things are super fast, man. Yep, snake. And there was some lizards up here. I'll tell you what. I caught it. 
Bunch of them. It's a whole family. We'll try to run now. We good? We all right? Dude, our health, man. We have stuff for our health. That's not health. That's six. But it's for poisoning. <laughs> I'm a little paranoid. All I want from these guys is the hide, which we don't have. All right, where is this? All of you. So we're good there. We got some more branches. I like it. A little bit of fruit as well. And I do have one of these. We can go ahead and eat this. Get our water all the way up. I think I might start doing that instead of having the, the canteens. To save the green coconuts because you get so much more for a little bit of space versus having to try to stock up all the water. We're going the right way we are. Wait. Is that going to be up there? Let's try to focus, man. That might be up here. It is. Nice view of the island. I think that's a little island that we started off on, right? Nope, it's not. Or not started on, but we put our campfire on. Actually, I think it is. What is this? We should be able to get to that from over here. We can. Let's go ahead and drag our cart in there. Watch out for the jaguar. Take that out. Yep, fall damage. Perfect. As if our health isn't low enough anyways. Get through here. I hear the bird. What is that way? Harpies. Lizards. Pineapple, dragon fruit. Okay, a lot of stuff. A lot of resources. Let's do this. Let's leave the cart there. Is that the... That's scrap. Is that the jaguar? Is that a dead lizard? What was that? What was that? Was he faking it? Well, that's kind of bugged. <laughs> dude, that's kind of weird, man. I'm just saying, dude. All right, where is the Jaguar? The bone. I hear you. I just don't see you. There's the jaguar. Crouch down. Nice. Got a good shot. Please run in a straight line. Run in a straight line. Got you. <laughs> Help me help you, man. Cooperate here. All right, what do we have? Do we have a trophy for the Jaguar? I don't think we do. And take it all. I know we're wasting time. The day is already kind of going along, but that's not too bad. We got him taken care of. What is this? Long stick. Okay, look. It looked like it was something different. There's the copper mine. Let's see how much is in it. That'd be kind of funny if they threw you a curveball and had a separate or a second Jaguar over here. 19! Oh, dude! So, we can fully mine this out with this one pick. It's going to take us how long? 3 hours and 34 minutes. We are going to be out of stamina. i tell you what, we might just do the whole thing. Oh, it's going to put us in nighttime. We can't. Let's do this. Take a look over here. See what this is all about. Buffalo Potion. Do we have one of those already? Health regen, plus 132. That is not bad at all. Over two hours. Here's four disease ranks. Nice. Of all diseases. It's awesome. And then... Restores maximum health. That is not too bad. So I guess 132 is maximum. So we got the recipe we can do for that eventually. So right now we got unlocked snake potion. Oh, we do got the buffalo. Oh, we got to make that for sure. And that's a Jaguar one. What is this? Ah, Song of the Buffaloes. 
The greatest craftsmen of all four tribes were the buffaloes. I'm mean, gonna kind of see why with the health potion. Skillful were their hands, watchful were their eyes, and ingenious were their minds in creating the best weapons and the best tools. The strongest boats were made by their axes. The most solid houses were built by their hands. The most accurate tools were invented by their bright minds. And there were no better builders and craftsmen among the four tribes than the ones of the buffaloes. I like the buffaloes, man. Not too bad. Good group of people. <laughs> just saying, dude. Just saying. A little bit of obsidian. We'll take the bone. We don't really need it too much. Seems how we got obsidian for our arrows. I think we're kind of good. There's another one of the cannon trees. Let's harvest this. It is nighttime. I know. I know. We keep going back and forth. Let's take a nap. There's a bed of leaves up there. Where is our stuff? It's over here. Hey, what? Give me this. Give me that. Might as well. Let's leave all this stuff into here. It's full already. How is that full? That's not that heavy. All right, well, we're going back to the boat. I was going to sleep over here and just do some... Do some harvesting first thing in the morning, but let me go back to the boat. I'll empty all this. And then I'll see you in the morning right back here. We'll do some mining. We'll grab everything from that if we can. I'll see how much space is left on the boats. And I tell you what, actually, let's just harvest it all. If we have to leave some in our storage here, it's fine. At least we have it already harvested up and the respawn can kind of start taking place. And we'll kind of go from there. Dude, it has been a rough morning. The amount of snakes in between the boat and here. So I got bit a couple times. Use the treatment, and now I got bit again just a minute ago, and we have it again. So it's it's a thing. Chance of worsening is zero. Recovery is 30. I thought that this was supposed to prevent it. Oh, it can get worse from venomous animal bites. Okay, that's what happened. Interesting. Okay, well, is what it is. It's fine. Let's grab our stuff. We're heading back soon anyways. Let's see about this. I want to take all of it. We're going to be super overweight. Not a problem. It's going to bring all of this down. We're going to be a little bit low on our water, our food, our health, because we're going to be uh, kind of like out of uh, stamina, right? I really need to see how much the coffee works. Let's do this. Yep, continue anyways. Nice, dude. Nice. Everything in one trip. Can I? There we go. We can't reach you. So that's full and we're full. That is kind of perfect. Oh, dude, we cannot get any closer on that. So we should be able to... Fit all this on the boat, I think. I think we got enough room on the boat. We should be good. All right, let's head back there. <laughs> we are super tired. We're going to be taking some health damage from being overtired, but is what it is. Oh, we are super slow because of no energy. I didn't think about that. At least all of these snakes in between here and the boat are dead. I mean, hopefully, unless they have respawned, which is a possibility. Our health is going down because of our stamina, too. So it's kind of nice, though. So we got, what was it, 19... 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. I think we've got like 24 on the copper. So that's going to be 12 of the ingots, right? Because it's a 2 to 1 ratio. So that's not too bad. That should allow us to build the boats. And then there was a couple other things we want to build too. Now, I don't think we're going to go ahead and do the armor right yet. Let's we'll see. How much does it cost for that? Spelling is hard sometimes. That is three ingots for each one. That's good armor, though. Twelve for each piece. It's actually kind of nice, man. That's like, really, that's 48 more on the armor. So is that on top of the normal other armor? Not too sure. Arrowhead, nails. Copper knife would be very, very nice. Hmm. Super expensive, though. All right, look, we need to get back to the boats. We are in very bad shape. Let's get back to the boats. Load everything up and see where we are at in life. Hey, you know, I didn't think about it. We should take a nap right here. Should be fun. All we need is a little bit of energy. And it doesn't really matter if it's nighttime whenever we wake up because all we're doing is getting back to the boat. Let's do that. Couple hours. Let's not do... I mean, we could do 12. Let's do this so we heal up some. Let's grab... A little bit of that. We're good on food. Let's just sleep until morning. That'll give us almost full on our health, and then our energy, too. We might be able to grab the copper. I want to see how much space we actually have left. Nice, dude. Nice. That is not bad at all. We should probably go ahead and make this into a proper camp. I think all we got to do is add a couple more of the workbenches. 
but at least we're moving full speed. Especially if we're going to be over here doing a lot of harvesting. Now that might all change once we get the catamaran because it might have a better bed. Hopefully it's going to have bigger storage, so we might be able to do all of our clean out kind of in one trip, right? That's kind of what I'm hoping. But we'll see how much space is left on the boat and the cart when we're done. I wouldn't mind grabbing all of that clay so it can start respawning. That's a lot of clay, man. Now we probably can't harvest all of it because all we have is the wooden shovel. But we'll grab as much as we can. Alright, so we might not be able to take all of it. I think our weight doesn't count for the boat's weight either. Actually, we have everything. Nice, dude, nice! Let's take these two. As much as we can to kind of clean it all out. We'll leave the shovels. We don't need those back at base. We can leave that bamboo flask. Now, let's take it with us. I don't trust leaving it. So that's totally empty for the cart. Now, how much is a clay weigh for each one? We got some clay over here, I think. So, 51, 57. Not too much, so... We won't be able to get all the clay. We could probably grab most. Let's wait. We'll try to build a copper shovel, and that probably will help us out with that for harvesting all that up. And we'll leave the wooden ones, maybe use those first just to get rid of them. But we're somewhat set here. Let's sell back <laughs> while everything's somewhat decent. Very, very good haul today. Oh, dude, I am super happy with being able to clean out all of those copper mines. Now, like I said, we'll try to keep an eye on this one over here that's already started to respawn and see if the actual number starts going up depending on the days. I kind of hope it does. Let's go back here. Back to base. Ah, oh, dude. So nice, man. So nice fast traveling right back to base. And then we'll be right at our docking place, too. I can't wait to set one up over on Copper Island. Now, I don't know if I'm going to do it on the right side or the left side. If we do it on the right side of the island, that's kind of where the cart is. The problem with that is, if we want to go to the other islands, we're kind of a, a long swim around. But it's closer for the cart. So, I don't know, man. I don't know. We'll see. Let's dock. Can we... There we go. Always get stuck. Let's kind of clean some stuff out real quick before we go. Mainly the stuff that will spoil. You're super heavy on weights. I need to make up some more of the poison stuff. I'll tell you what, the ladder. The ladder! The poison stuff is no joke, dude. We really need to get some more of that made up. I think that's the only thing now that is holding us back. Seems how we don't have to worry about... Everything with these. Repair is only one tendon thread? Oh, that is not bad at all. Take quite the durability hit, though. What about the other stuff? Same thing. Two of those. Interesting. That's not too bad. So I wonder if that's the same thing for the copper one. The copper might take one ingot for repairs. Dude, we are going to be so heavy on food in our storage. I need to sort this out. I need to make one for medical stuff and one for just foods, or... Stop harvesting so much food. We've got a ton of the raw meat, a ton of the rotten food, too. It's the way that it goes sometimes. Speaking of food, let's eat you. I think what we'll do is... We need to get the smelter kind of going. Is it this one? It is. Oh, you know what? We need this going, too. Oh, we can make the... The fire starter, too. Where are we at in life? Where is... I think it's over here. Check this out before we go. There's a flint. Flint shard. What do we have? Oh, that's actual flint. Oh, that's an actual fire starter. So that's not too bad. Once that breaks, we have a whole other one. Hmm, so we still need a flint shard to make the other one. It's the only piece of the pyrite that we found, too. Interesting. Well, that's not too bad, then, seems that we have that. I'll grab a little bit of tinder. I have been using the cattail. We need four of them. Because it takes two each time we start stuff. Okay, so that is actually broke. I need to get some more stuff for this as well. that's running. You can hear it. And then we need this one running, too. Fuel is good on this. Alright, so that's going there. I need some of the sticks for this. 
You don't need a ton more sticks. It's ten sticks for each time that you do that. Oh, I need some actual fuel for this as well. Ah, dude, I tell you what. I need to go out and harvest some. I'll probably grab some from over there. The sticker bushes. Should have done that over on the other island. I didn't think about it. I thought I had more of them here. And that's good there. That's smelting up. How much do we have? So that's almost ready. I want to get all this food out so it doesn't spoil the main thing. And then the rest I can do off camera. Oh yeah, we want to put that up too. How's our weight? We're doing good on weight. That should be it. I mean, minus that. I'm going to leave that in there. Let's grab our hammer. Put up our last trophy. We don't have one, do we? We don't. Alright, let's equip you. Let's place you. Kind of small. It's another small one. Let's do a small one. I guess right here. We'll be fine. And then whenever we get a, another small one, we'll put it right there. It'll be kind of set. I like the trophies, man. I didn't think I was going to. I kind of like them. I do like how you get the hides to put on the ground. Now, we haven't really got any hides in a while. It'd be nice to get a buffalo one. Which, how long until those things respawn? Wait, let's do this. And this. We got two more islands up there to check out, too. <laughs> it's gonna... It's, it's a lot, dude. It's a lot. And just think, they're still working on a ton of the other stuff, too, right? That's already respawned. Unless there's one there that we didn't kill off. There's some over there, too. So leather is not going to be an issue. So regardless, we should be able to still keep up with the leather. And it's becoming to where food is, like, a lot more than we need. Ah, dude. Well, not too bad of a day. Actually, a very good day. We got a ton of the copper. I think we got enough for 12 ingots. Next video, I want to build the other boat. I know, I know. We got everything set up for this. But we should be able to expand the base if we need to. I want to get the catamaran. The main thing holding us back right now from being over there and doing a lot of harvesting is storage space. We could have got all that copper, or not copper, but the clay, if we had more storage. So I think it'll be a good upgrade. We'll, we'll build it and see what it's like. The new armor was fantastic. We didn't get any heat stroke. We didn't have problem with the wind, no problem with the sun. It makes life a lot easier. And then having the copper pickaxe over there was a game changer too. So kind of excited for getting the copper tools. And just think, man, there's still iron that we have to get to later on as well. However, we are going to go ahead and leave this one here. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you enjoyed our massive mining excursion over on Copper Island today. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.